Namaste. Today, in this video, we are going to solve this previous graph which we have solved by using forward approach. We are solving this same graph by using backward approach that is also known as forward reasoning. Okay. So, let us consider the same graph and in backward approach, we substitute the value from initial case or initially we calculate the value from initial process so it is also known as forward reasoning but where in forward approach we have to find first value and substitute backward so it is called backward reasoning now in backward approach we directly calculate a d s a so s a is one okay and d s b it is equals to 2 d s c it equals to 5 and we have to find the value of d s d so d s d is equals to minimum value from so d can be reached from a to b a to d also b to d okay so minimum value of d s a when we go from a it becomes d s a plus d a d okay and when we go from b d s b plus d b d so these are the two facts okay so minimum <coughs> sorry so d s a is one plus a d is equals to four and DSB is 2, BD is equals to 9. So what is the minimum value between 5 and 11? It is 5. Similarly, we calculate for DSE. Okay, SE. So there are how many part? DAE, sorry, DSA plus DAE, DSB plus dbe yes there are two parts and we get minimum value as seven please do it yourself okay and d s f okay when we go to dsf we go from d s b plus d b f or d s c plus d c f so the minimum value between two is seven okay write it yourself okay now, DST. Finally, we reach to DST. So, DST can be gone from DSA plus DS, so DAD AD plus DDT and DSB plus DBE plus DET. Okay, or we can directly write DST from like this minimum value from d s d because we can reach minimally from uh, this part to this by choosing from minimum value yes okay so d s d plus d d t okay and next maybe d s e plus d e t and next may be d s f plus d f t so we get the minimum value as 9 yes that was the previous value by using forward approach but in this process it is somehow difference because we substitute in uh, value from initial process yes now similarly as in forward approach we write by stage d d one s d second stage are a b and c so a d to b d to c and third stage there are three verses d s okay this may be capital or small it is okay and e D, third stage F, and fourth stage there was okay T. 
So, same as previous for initial and terminal stage, we write it as 0. So, 2a that means dsa, okay. dsa is equals to 1, sb equals to 2, sc equals to 5, and dsd. So, dsd it was 5, dse it was 7, dsf it was 7. So, we select the minimum from each stage. So, first stage S, S. In second stage, 1, 2, and 5. The minimum value is A. In third stage, 5, 7, and 5. The minimum value is D. And in fourth stage, T. So, this is the stage, state part by using backward approach. In this way, we have found the part from S to T by using backward approach of dynamic programming. Okay. In next video, I will be solving knapsack problem. Okay. 0 1 knapsack problem by using dynamic programming. Thank you and bye bye.